everybody and welcome back to the channel if you haven't already make sure to go and press those like and subscribe buttons down below and also turn on your notifications so you don't miss out on any of my videos so what's happening today so today we have a little bit of an issue with the automatic scrapers so as some of you may know we have automatic scrapers that go up and down our passageways so we have two of them and this is one of them and we also have one over there so these scrapers that scrape these two passageways, they are both broken, which is really not that great during winter because all the muck that is pushed down here, um, every all the piece of all muck and all dirt is pushed down there into the slats. But since these scrapers aren't going, it creates a whole pile of muck. We have to use the Massey 135. Um, at night time in the morning and during the day. So you're probably thinking, how can you scrape the passageways when during the day when the cows are in here? So the, what we have to do is we have to do it with a hand scraper. So as you probably know, that is, that's going to be a lot of work because it's uh, quite a big passageway and it, there's quite a lot of mud gathers in it. Before we scrape the passageways with the Massey, we are going to get doing some of these cubicles and um, getting them nice and clean for when the cows come in after milking. So we're currently milking at the minute, the evening milking, and we need to get these cubicles done so the cows can have a nice bed when they come back in. So about the only positive thing about this automatic scrapers not working is you can get all the sawdust and old sawdust and poo all all into the passageways before you scrape it so it's really nice and clean for when the cows come in because if the automatic scraper was going and um, it might have gone before you had got um, the top top cubicles done and it just really makes the cubicles or the passageways nice and clean for when the cows come in if the scraper isn't working so just while I remember, I thought I'd show you something um, that happened last night and also um, that's, very, that's very good that's happened. So don't tell anyone about this guy, it's very secret. No one about me knows, no one apart from me knows it. It's not those two little um, ones behind me, but it's further up into the calving pens. And I'll just go in here. And we had our last calf. So calving for 2021 um, has finished. And I'll just show you the two last calves. So this is the, it's very dark in here, but wait, let me turn the light on. So while we are trying to show the calves, someone left the gate open, don't know who, someone left the gate open. Cow that was meant to get AI is now in with all these other ones that have just been milked. So now we have to try and find her, get her back up there and put her into the waiting pen beside the um, milking parlour. So yeah, we're going to try and do that now and this video is going very, very well because first of all, there was no light for the calves, so I couldn't show the calves, so I'll show in the morning. Couldn't find a torch. Hey, miss, go up. Psst. So, yeah, I don't know quite what I was saying, but, um, yeah, we still need to go and get that cow 36. She's in with the milking cows, and this video is not going mm. as planned. And I'm just going to show you the calves, and it all tumbled from there. The lights aren't working in here now, so we're going to have to get those fixed. We're going to have to get the scrapers fixed. And we're going to have to get 36 out of the... With the milk, other milking cows, so yes. That's what we're going to have to do now. And I have to get... Also, I'll try and show you those calves in the morning, if I remember. But yeah, try my best to make this video a little bit better, but... It's not going great at the moment. Uh, so we've just finished all of the cubicles and now we're ready to scrape these. Those cows up there are, um, they won't be staying with us any longer. They'll be going soon because a lot of them are quite old and a lot of them have very bad feet. So we're gonna move them down into here because we're not scraping this bit. 
and then we'll be able to scrape these but I first of all need to go and get the 135 so we can actually scrape them it's so dark I can hardly see anything So we've got the Massey there, you'll be able to see it. And we're now going to move these ones down, down there. So I'm going to try and open this chain with one hand. Which, and film. Oh, I did it. Didn't think I'd be able to do that. Filming isn't probably that great, but if I open this gate, I need to run. And they got out this morning. And I don't really want that to happen again, so... The filming is probably absolutely shocking, but sorry about that. I just don't want them to escape. I get, oh, flip, this gate's going again. I need to get them all down in, into here so I can get these scraped. Now I'm taking a risky move with leaving that gate like it is. So, um, yeah. Come on, girls. Ho, 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 ho. They can just stay in there for a wee while. Come on, girls. Oh. Good girl.
we've now got both um, alleyways, this one and passageways, this one and this one, both clean. That bit's in there is clean because the uh, lily scraper's just done it and the bit over there is also clean because the lily scraper has also done it. So now we're going to let these these ones back into their pen up there and then we'll repeat that all again tomorrow unless we get it fixed. So we're back about two, two weeks after in the last video that I took. So um, we've got some great news. The scrapers are working again. So they're both they're all, they're scraping the alleys now, which is great. And now we don't have to scrape them. So I thought I'd just show you a bit on what happened with the scrapers. So I'll just explain. So this is our big scraper up in there. And... Um, this scraper broke and what happened was the seal inside the ram um, just got worn out which meant um, it wouldn't come up um, and scrape so we, we got that fixed and was working fine and then guess what happened the little scraper broke and we had to fix it so now we've got um, the little scraper and the big scraper working um, which is really good and it means we won't have to scrape them anymore and hopefully we won't have any more problems with them for a while um, but yeah it's making it doing a really good job of the um, of the sl of the passageways and you can probably see if I'll just go up to the top here you can probably see um, that it's a lot cleaner now um, a night than the time that we showed you by scraping the um, it with the tractor and the reason for that is just um, scrapers going more often and it's just keeping it more cleaner so um, um, maybe once uh, I think it's going nine times a day which is just keeping it really clean and we were only doing it maybe three times a day and um, which was a third um, a third of what it would be going so um, at least it's keeping the passageways a lot cleaner. So you might have seen a gate behind me. So you'll have to wait for a few videos time just to see what's behind that gate and what's happened. So yeah, you'll need to wait and find out um, in a few videos time. Probably won't be next week's video as and we've got other stuff for next week's video. But just wait and see because we've got a few um, mischiefy mischievous little things behind that gate so yeah make sure to go and check that out in a few weeks time